I'm the Green Thumb Gardener. Today I'm here to show you my pawpaw seeds here. So these pawpaw seeds, they have to be stratified over the winter. I got the pawpaws in here. So I'm gonna be transplanting those today. All right, yeah, uh, I just got some water retaining crystals here. So I'm gonna put this in to the, the mixture because it's summer here, it's a drought. You know, uh, water tends to evaporate pretty quickly in a drought so I'll put this in it so that'll help retain some of the moisture water retaining crystals in here so I just put a little bit of water retaining crystals in here so I'm gonna fill this up with a bit of water here Just let that sit over here for a second. I'm gonna show you this. Oh wow, look at how much water that absorbed. Now it's all like a a jelly almost. It's kind of spongy. But yeah, that's a lot of water. It soaked it all up. So you saw the crystals before, now look at them. Wow, that really expanded. Uh, yeah, look at how much water it absorbed. So they are good to plant if you're in a drought and you're using pots, because it helps retain moisture. Think about it. Alright, so now I filled my, my cans up here halfway, so now I'm going to put uh, some organic fertilizer in here. This one, it contains uh, mycorrhiza, which is a beneficial fungus that has a symbiotic relationship with the plants. So the, uh, the fungus gets sugars, and in return, the fungus gives the plants nutrients. So it uh, probably... Uh, expands their root range so they can have uh, grab nutrients from a lot farther in space. Alright, got those all potted up now. Got the pots filled up. So then we're gonna take the pawpaw seeds here. See here's a seed here. You have to overwinter this seed. Basically you have to Put it in an area, maybe like under a tree, where you let it sit there for a year, and then you start to get these afterwards. So, put that in there. Take this one. Put that one in. Here, it's got a pretty long root on it. Here I got some bush beans, and I'm going to be potting those up too. I usually do my white gloves, I put them on earlier. I usually do it when I work with soil. like to cover the soil or the water retaining crystals because they tend to pop up out of the pot.
Happy gardening.